I'm going to show you TextHelp's PDF uh, reader and viewer uh, for Drive. So I'm going to first launch Drive. If I can get that window out of the way. There we go. What we're going to do is we're going to connect uh, the PDF, TextHelp PDF viewer or reader to Drive. We do that by going to uh, Settings. And in Settings, we will select Manage Apps, which is over here on the left. This allows us to play with different things that are directly connected to Drive. Notice that I, I like Kami quite a bit, but I'm not going to use it, so I do have that selected. And there's also a split and merge Kami down here somewhere. I have that deselected. So moving all the way down, I, I was reading right. And let's see if text help. There's text help PDF reader. So that we want to have active. Select done. If you don't have it, you can connect more apps and find it that way. I know that I have some PDF documents uh, here in Minute Folder. And so I'll open one of those up. And we'll do learn a little bit about world history today. Nothing like the Byzantine uh, Empire, Byzantine Empire, however you say it. And so you can see that Read and Write is already launching. And what it's asking me to do is to uh, install the extension. So it connects to through Drive, and then it also wants you to install the extension to Chrome. Doing so makes it work. Okay, we'll close that down. Get back to our document. Waiting is always a good time. Notice the PDF reader is kind of taking over the document. Patience is a virtue. So here's our toolbar. Reading tools here. Annotation tools, a little bit of translation, uh, the screenshot reader for things that are helpful. This one is actually a typewriter, so you can actually annotate over the top. So it would work pretty well for uh, worksheets. Um, dictionary support and uh, click to speak, I think, if you wanted to um, add an audio annotation or actually it may also do a text to speech uh, conversion. So I can scroll down a bit, get to some text. Maybe if I use my arrows, that would even be better. So navigating can be kind of exciting. Um, I do have, I'm going to deviate for a moment, selecting this purple downward arrow, going to options. I have continuous reading selected. It doesn't appear to default that way. Uh, otherwise, you're going to have to select everything that you want not very helpful. So positioning my cursor, hitting the read button or play. Oh. Okay, that worked out good for one thing. So let's highlight the whole sentence. In 1203, when the Crusaders arrived at Constantinople, they were amazed by its splendor. Highlight a little more. Actually, I might want to highlight all of it. And read. T. Hose who had never seen Constantinople opened wide eyes now, for they could not believe that so rich a city could be in the whole world. When they saw her lofty walls and her stately towers, where pause or play will stop the read. We can continue to navigate to the next page uh, as needed. 
but that's how the PDF uh, reader works in uh, from TextHelp.